Welcome to another episode of Mint Talk. One of the aspects that give collector coins their value is their metal composition, for example, gold or silver. I'm here today in the Mint's refinery vault with Alex Reeves, and we're here to discuss the various types of metals that uh, we use in our collector coins. Hi, Alex. Hey, Eric. What can you tell me about this particular room that we're in today? Well, we're in one of the uh, Royal Canadian Mint's refinery vaults. The Mint is the only mint in the world to refine its own gold. Now, I see that you actually brought a few gold coins along with you today to, to, to show. Yes, I did. Uh, and uh, I'm just, I want to show you the different compositions that uh, we make here at the Royal Canadian Mint. The first one is a five nines a pure gold coin. That's 99.999% pure. Uh, it means that it has less than 10 parts per million of other metals. Uh, and also the Royal Canadian Mint is the only mint in the world to refine gold to that purity. And this, uh, this rather exclusive coin, uh, made in very limited quantities, retails for just under $1,000. The next one I've brought is a four nines pure gold coin. Um, again, the mint back in 1982 was the first to refine gold to four nines purity, 99.99%. And um, uh, this, is, uh, this is a standard composition for our pure gold coin. When you see pure gold coin on the Mint website or certificate, it's four nines pure. And the last one that I brought is uh, a more affordable kind of uh, gold coin. Everybody's familiar with 14 karat gold. And this coin is, um, is just, uh, just a little over 50% 50, 50 pure gold. Moving on to silver, do the Mint's silver collector coins have the same range of purities as gold dust? Uh, not quite, Eric. Um, almost all of our uh, fine silver coins are made of 99.99% pure silver, uh, like this example that I have here. Um, in the past, we've also done some uh, sterling silver coins, which are 92.5% silver and 7.5% copper. Um, silver is a beautiful uh, metal for creating coins. Uh, it's extremely popular uh, among our collectors and it's a, uh, a very reasonable alternative to gold as well. Aside from gold and silver, uh, does the Mint use any other metals to produce uh, its collector coins? Uh, certainly, Eric. Um, actually, uh, platinum is an extremely uh, popular and coveted metal, uh, precious metal, I should say, and it's uh, made of, uh, at a purity level of 99.95%, which is the industry standard for platinum. Uh, we also uh, produce uh, other coins in uh, uh, palladium, uh, we've done in the past, uh, also uh, nickel-plated steel, uh, we've also done copper and bronze, so uh, it's quite possible that you could see some of these, uh, these, uh, these other metal varieties in our future. And where would our customers find information about uh, the metal composition of a given coin? Well, customers can look up all of our coins on mint.ca. There's a product page for each coin that we sell. And uh, the specifications are listed on the right, so the purity is, is clearly indicated there. But most importantly, you can find it on every certificate because the Mint guarantees the purity of a coin in writing. Thanks, Alex. Keep following us on YouTube and be sure to visit us on Facebook to stay up to date on all the latest coin news.